head down to the coin toss now. It's brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coca-Cola taste and zero calories. Enjoy everything. Bush is lined up and just about ready to send this one off as we're ready to get this game underway. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. That's a great tackle at the 27-yard line. The running back gets two on the carry. From their own 27-yard line, it's second down. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five-wide outlook. Makes the catch, and look out. He's knocked out of bounds at the 33-yard line. Change of quarterback, Kirby. you got to wonder what that's going to do to the team morale. It is next man up. They've got to be ready to trust this guy. deep to return he puts it away and it's a great kick how about the coverage there just a great job there by the punt team to get downfield and make the play on the return man before he could get loose the quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game the stop around the 30-yard line. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. Casey with the play fake, and they got him. This quarterback has to do a better job of avoiding the rush, because sacks can be real drive killers. Picks him up two yards with that catch. Wiggins to punt. Booming kick. He gets hit out of bounds at the 36. This is a fun game, and I think we're going to see a lot of interesting football before it's over. And he was able to pick up some nice yards on the return. The middle for a nice game. That's a game seven. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. And he shoved out of bounds at the 42. He got the ball, and he was off like a shot. This guy has some big time speed. the 27-yard line. That was a really nice play on the ball by the receiver for a substantial gain and a first down. It's first and 10. Ball on the 27-yard line. 
Tackle right around the 26 yard line. It's third down, and this offense is about three feet away from that first down marker. Tackle outside after a nice pickup. They're eating up a lot of field on this drive. I'm really impressed with their ball control. run and he's brought down. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. Get to that quick and it's going the other way. Good job to pick that ball off. He did a great job at getting in that passing lane and coming away with the ball. From their own six-yard line, it's first down. Mike four, Mike four. <laughs> nice run up the middle. Call it a gain of four yards. That'll make it second to seven. Down around the 27-yard line. We've got a first and ten. Ball on their own 27. throws it away. Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. Pulls it in. First down, and he's knocked out of bounds. First and ten. Ball on the 41-yard line. Strike to his receiver, no good. We played one. No score here. That makes it second and ten. Back to the action now here in the second quarter. Fagan takes it up the middle. So the draw to the halfback picks up four. down now and they need to get it inside the 49. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. Ninth play of the current drive. Down, down. 
Pulls it in and he's in the open field. That'll make it second and seven. It's second down, seven to go. Ball on the 36. Throws it in a hurry. And down he goes around the 22-yard line. It's the 11th play of the drive. The ball is loose. Defense has it. It's one of the corners. Personal foul. Personal foul. Clipping. Clipping. Offense. Offense. And the defense gives up some three yards to the offense. Uh, you know, penalties can ruin a team's chances to win if they commit too many. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 37. Takes the ball inside. They go to the left for a nice game. That brings him second and five. First and ten, ball on the 34. sophomore linebacker there who was able to get in and make that tackle. Makes it out to about the 20. From the 20-yard line, first down. Just throws this one away. Just a sound play by the defense. They dropped him well short of the line of scrimmage. It looks like they're going to try for the long field goal. This to try to put his team up by a field goal.
They try to get a head start there. False start, start. offense. Maybe he got the cadence wrong coming out of the huddle. The coaches have a low down. threshold for mistakes like that. Fourth down and a ways to go after the penalty. He gets it up and it's long enough and it's good. They line up to kick this one away. These tackles at the 25-yard line. Well, it's always fun to be part of a defensive battle, and that's certainly what we have right now. Yeah, give credit to both of these defenses. I mean, they, they're playing with a lot of energy, and I think they're doing a nice job up front at the line of scrimmage. At this point, they're not giving this either of these offenses a chance to make a play. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Fires up to his receiver. He's to the 40. He's pushed out of bounds at the 45-yard line. That makes it good. From their own 45-yard line, first down. Calls a timeout. Nice pickup as they connect on the pass play. Well, they look to be in sync right now. They're both reading the defense properly, and the result is a nice game. There's a fumble. Scoops it up. Wow, very close to turning it over, but they'll keep possession of the football. Way to play heads up out there. That's just one more reason to play to the whistle. They'll bring him down at the 36-yard line. Good gain on the pass to the running back. This young man is becoming more and more part of this passing game. He does a great job of making guys miss after the catch. He's got it with room to run. He's out of bounds around the 20-yard line. down 10 yards to go ball on the 20 quick strike to the receiver nice play to set up first and goal he's scrambling and he's going to run this one in. Touchdown. He splits the uprights with the extra point. A nice seven-play, 73-yard drive, and they come away with a touchdown. Brett, I thought the key to that drive really had a lot to do with the quarterback and the receivers getting in sync, making it very tough for the defense to slow them down. So our score, 7-3. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Taken down at about the 35. A nice looking play that time. Well, the defense was blitzing here, and again, great recognition by the quarterback to find the hot receiver. Got his man. Can't tack on any yardage. They get four yards on that pass play. You know, little passes like this force the defense to start to come up. Then you can see an offense take their chances downfield later to take advantage of the defense. And it's intercepted. That's a great tackle at the 21-yard line. 
Nice interception and an even nicer vertical. Oh, yeah. This guy's an athlete. There's no throwing it over this guy's head. He'll go up and get it. Give some credit to this corner. He's only a freshman and making plays like that. From their own 21-yard line, it's first down. Keeps it on the option play and picks up six. A tight first half of football, and we head to the break. Seven, three. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. Defense has been in total control in the first half, and you'd think maybe the offense's confidence would shaken. But if you want to look at the entire team picture, David, how big a deal is it for an offense to know, look, if we can just put together one, maybe two good scoring drives, our defense has got our back. Well, a lot of times when you know you have a defense, it's great too, is you build your offense around it. And when I say that, why do I need to take chances? You know, if it's third and long, I don't mind throwing a five-yard pass, and if I break a tackle, I get a first down. I mean, don't put my defense that's dominant, that's great, in a bad position, and, and you can afford to be more conservative. You see it every single year. What do we always talk about here at ESPN? We talk about you, you defense wins championships, and that's how you win ball games, and you see it consistently unfold. So if I'm building an offense, Let's just not put my great dominant defense in a bad position. That's it for us here in the studio. What are you going to do in the second half of the game's going on? Yeah, I'm going to kick back and watch all these monitors. We'll keep you up to date on everything going on around the country right now. Time for the second half with Brad and Kirk. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set for the second half. Maxwell fields it at the 11. Tackle made at the 31-yard line. We're about set to start things up again. He goes out of bounds at the 40. It's second down now. They're just a few feet away from that first down marker. knocked it loose. That's pretty much the best way to make sure the receiver doesn't catch it. He just put his pads on him the second he touched it. This is a big first down for this offense. I think it's another good example about how important it is to have an awareness about you as a wide receiver. Wide receiver did a really good job of knowing exactly where the first down marker was, and he made sure to get the route at least to that point, so when he made the catch and got hit, he had the first down. He lost the ball. They fall on it. What do you think about that last turnover, Kirk? Way to be heads up out there. That corner just made one heck of a play recovering that fumble. They're going to review this fumble, and I've got to tell you, I think he was down before the ball popped loose. I don't know about this one, Brad. They called it a fumble on the field, and they need indisputable video evidence to overturn this call. After, After review of the play, play, the ruling on the field, field is reversed. reversed. So the call on the field will be reversed. From their own 43-yard line. Second down. And he carries the ball for a nice game.
Halfback's got it on the quick throw. And they make the stop at about the 37-yard line. From the 37-yard line, first down. He stopped immediately. Got an opening. And they get nice yardage on that run. The thing I love about this guy is he can throw the ball, he can run it, and that's hard to stop. From the 23-yard line. First down. Scrambling around. They bring him down. The defenders played the snap count perfectly. He found the path into the backfield and didn't let the quarterback get away. Now we'll see how the backup can do after that injury. And they take him down immediately. And they'll look to convert here on another third down. Kirk, good news. The guy that we saw go to the locker room with that injury earlier is back on the sideline, and I got to bet he's going to be back in the game soon. Now he's scrambling. He scrambled and picked up a couple of yards. It's up, and they tack on three points. Bush looks ready to kick this one off. Excellent kick. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. I think this defense has played well enough to be able to win this game, obviously. But at some point, you'd love to see their own offense feed off of some of the confidence that their defense is playing with because up to this point the defense is keeping them in the game but the offense isn't quite doing enough to be able to build on that lead he's under some heat fires right side got his tail back that makes it second and ten From their own 25-yard line, it's second down. And he's taken down at about the 45. able to get ahead of steam on that carry. Second down and 11 yards to the sticks. Ball on the 44-yard line. Makes the catch and he's got nowhere to go. Spread the field with five wide. And down he goes at the 25. That makes it first and ten.
from the 25 yard line. It's first down. The handoff on the counter. Tackle made at the 22 yard line. That'll make it second and seven. It's second down, seven to go. Ball on the 22-yard line. Mike 35, Mike 35. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tries to fit it in there, and it'll be intercepted. And he might take this. This shows some great preparation by the defensive staff. It seems like he can't throw a pass without a defender knowing where it's headed. We head to the final quarter, and we've got a great game on our hands. 10-3. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. Fires out to his wideout. He's tackled around the 39-yard line. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. around the 49-yard line. Flag down, and I'm not sure when it was thrown. Let's find out. Offense. Flipping is the call, and now they'll have to find a way to make up those yards right here. It's second and six. Ball on their own 35. Pick up a four on the play. You don't have to throw it deep to have success. Any sort of completion can help boost an offense's confidence. Under pressure, he wants it all going long. Caught by the sophomore, and he's tackled at the 10. So let's see how the defense responds now. It's first down and 10. You know, these backwards plays can have a psychological impact. It can damage a team's confidence if it keeps happening. So it's another third down upcoming here. Hand off and he won't make it. Good job by the defense to overpower the offensive line and drop the back for a loss. Just under three to go in regulation. Kicks away, and it sails through the uprights. Push, 
Has the ball all teed up, and he's ready to kick this one off. Sends it sailing downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Well, these defensive coaches have got to be loving what they've seen from their guys today. Well, you and I talked to both of these coordinators getting ready for this game, and they put together a game plan. They shared it with us, and we're seeing it out there on the field today. They still are going to determine the outcome of this game. Well, let's see if he can shake off that pick that he tossed last time out. And we'll see how aggressive this defense is when they come back out. I wouldn't be surprised if they kept up the pressure to try to fluster this quarterback some more. That brings them second and five. From their own 30-yard line, second down. Quick throw out to the receiver, incomplete. It's fourth down, and they're going to try to go for it. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. And he's level at the 28. And they're going to have to give the ball back after going for it on fourth and long. Not much you can do there. you got to go for it and give yourselves a chance. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. And he makes it out to about the 27-yard line. Second and nine. Ball on the 27. A one-yard gain by the halfback. Just under two minutes in the game. Fagan will run it again. Good outside run there. The defense calls a timeout. Dumps it complete to the halfback over the middle. He's taken down around the 24-yard line. The defense calls a timeout. And now they've got no timeouts left. Kick is away. It's long enough. And he splits the uprights. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. I tell you, you've got to tip your hat to the defense. They played well today. Well, this defense has done everything that's asked to them. They've slowed down the opposing offense. They've created turnovers. They've gotten pressure on the quarterback. In these last couple drives, they've just played probably the best they've played all game. And the defense stopped them cold on fourth down during their last drive. That stop gave this defense some momentum last time out. It'll be interesting to see if they can keep that intensity on this drive. And they make the stop at around the 38-yard line. Throws complete, he's hit right away. The spike will stop the clock. That'll make it third and five. We're down to our final minute of this ball game. The quarterback in the gun with five receivers. He's taken down around the 48-yard line. We have less than a minute to go. Gets it out quickly, and he hits him hard at the 43-yard line. That makes it second and two. And he stops the clock with a spike. That'll bring up third and two. And once again, they'll come to the line, try to convert on third down. They're not quite in field goal range, so this is a pretty important play on this drive. Caught out in the open, and 
they push him out right around the 30. Here's the eighth play of the series. Slings it, and he's tackled right away. Spikes the ball. That makes it third and seven. Well, they'll line it up again on third down. Two for two so far on this drive. And he might want it all here and does. Incomplete. I know this quarterback trusts his arm and his receivers, but he's got to know when not to throw the ball. He didn't have any room at all, and he's lucky it wasn't intercepted. Wants to throw outside. He's hit and taken down. He is such a reliable target. You throw it anywhere near him, and this guy's going to get his hands on it to make a catch. Defense would like to come up with another big play like they did in the last trip for this offense in the red zone with the interception. That makes it second and ten. From the 12-yard line, second down. Quick throw, tight end, touchdown. A huge pass and catch for the touchdown, and now we're down to a one-score game. And he tacks on the extra point. This might be it. They've got the lead, but if they add to it, they know they've got a victory. And this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. Nothing more demoralizing for a defense than seeing the opposing quarterback take a knee. And this one's final. We had a tight defensive-minded game today. Scoring was at a premium. 16-10. Thanks for joining us for another game of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk and everyone here at EA Sports, Brad Nussler saying goodbye, and we'll see you next time.